Hello everyone and welcome to Mobility Academy and the Flexibility Guy, Coach Alia. And in today's video, I want to show you a beautiful exercise to warm up and to stretch your shoulders at the same time. All right. But before I start, let me show you my brand new book, Shoulders Range, which is the complete playbook to master your shoulders and upper body flexibility. So if you want to stretch your shoulders, if you want a more flexible upper body, I strongly suggest you check out this book following the link in the description down below. All right. Now, with that said, let's start. All right, guys, so this is an excellent stretch and an excellent warm up for your shoulders, which works on a range of motion, which is often underrated, which is shoulder extension. All right, so we all want to stretch our shoulders like this, but we often forget that we can also stretch our shoulders like this in shoulder extension. And shoulder extension is good for your pecs, major and minor, for your delts and for, for your rotator cuff to stretch them up and also to warm up your posterior delts, your trapezius and all the muscles in the back part of your shoulders, all right? So we're going to work with the back muscles to create the stretch and to warm them up and to stretch the anterior part of our shoulders, all right? So all you have to do to sit down on floor with your feet in front of you like this, you wanna place your hands next to your glutes with your fingers pointing out. So don't look in front of you or back for, for now, of course, you can explore many variations, but we want to start from this. So with your fingers out, all right? Now, from this position, this is really important. The, the key factor in this exercise is how you activate your shoulders, all right? So you do want to bring your shoulders back and you want to bring your chest out, all right? So it's not about your ribs. So your ribs stay fixed, all right? You just want to bring the shoulders back a little back. All right, so shoulders back. I squeeze my shoulder blades together. All right, now I move my butt a little bit in front of me. Can you see that? A little, just a little bit. Now, keeping my shoulders strongly pulled back, I squeeze my shoulder blades together. I activate the back part of my shoulders, my back muscles. From this position here, I push up with my legs and with my shoulders, of course, this is not something we want to do only with the legs. I also want to push with my shoulders back like this. All right, so from this position here, I push my butt up until I get parallel to the floor. Can you see that? Now my shoulders have to stay on top of my hands. So not here or not here, on top of my hands. And I want to strongly pull my shoulders back. All right, so I push and I come back. Now, guys, it's really important that you don't push only your hips up. As you go up, you wanna push your chest as well up. So chest and hips up, but your abs stay in. All right, so let's do another time. Shoulders back, chest out, chest out, hips up, abs in. So I don't want to do something like only with the hips because I'm going to lose the activation here. I want to keep the strong activation on my shoulders. So shoulders back, chest up, hips up. But don't think only about the hips. Think about your chest as well. So chest up. All right. And I can repeat the movement usually eight to 10 times. Stay in the top position, couple of seconds for each rep. And on the final one, let's assume this is the final one. I wanna stay here longer. For example, five to 10 breaths. And I breathe here, I relax, I stay in the position, and then I come back. This is excellent. You're gonna feel the stretch in your chest, in your arms. This is really good. So, as I said, you can change also your hands position. Now, if you turn your hands back, you're going to stretch your bicep more. Because as you bring your shoulders in extension, this will stretch your biceps as well, a lot. So, as you bring your, if you have some kind of bicep stiffness, 
you can use this exercise for your biceps as well. So the same arms straight, go up, feel the stretch, really, really controlled. All right, so chest out, hips up, shoulders back, and come back. If you bring your arms, like your hands, sorry, with your fingers pointing in front of you, this is actually really good for your wrists flexibility because this is going to create a little bit of wrist um, flexion right here and it's going to stretch your forearm muscles and your wrists as well so different kind of positions of your hands which create a slightly different stretch of course you're going to stretch your pec minor major your delts and your rotator cuff in every kind of situation but as you move your hands you kind of change a little bit the focus on different muscles but they are all really good to warm up your shoulders and to work on your flexibility at the same time remember six to ten reps and on the final one you can remain there five to ten breaths you can do this just in a warm-up just in your warm-up you warm yourself up and you move your shoulders and work on your flexibility as well that's why it's really important to mix warm-up exercises with flexibility exercises and in this way you're going to do that you're going to work on your strength you're going to work on your flexibility and you're going to warm yourself up all right so a very very beautiful exercise but if you've got any questions any doubts any kind of um, particular requests about this particular exercise right here please feel free to leave a comment down below and remember that if you enjoyed the video leave a like to this video right here and help me grow this youtube channel all right guys it means a lot to me so with that said that's all from the flexibility guy coach alia have a nice stretch and see you in the next video.